Hello again, Doc on the Clock with more Search for the Eight Jewels by Marvel 7. We're going to uh, the Large Bridge. Oh, it's got a 3D-ish effect. Hopefully that doesn't come back to bite me. Oh dear. That... I got a little bit lucky there. Okay, that's solid. I wasn't actually sure if that was passed through or not. My... For some reason, my swimming didn't swim. Oh, that didn't go so well. Uh, nope, not getting up there. Not without a springboard or something. Oh. Hey, I've got a springboard. I've also died. Because I jumped on the springboard. Rather than grabbing it. Let that be a warning. Always grab what you're supposed to grab. And don't jump on it. Fortunately, I had almost enough coins for an extra life there, so... Yeah, swim, please. Not a fan of this setup here. I don't think my fandom is particularly of interest to the level designer, though. And up we go. And down we go, back into more water. I have no idea if that was a secret. No, there was no secret exit there. So, <laughs> essentially I just skipped half the level by being fast enough. I don't think that was intended. Ah, uh, I should at least go see what I missed. Alright. Now this is the challenge I was supposed to take. Ah, uh, wasn't much of one. <laughs> Castle 2. You can find the yellow jewel in this castle. Beat the boss to get it. What, I have to beat a boss? I have to go through all that work? Seems so rude. Why can't I just find the jewel? Also, who is the boss? Also, I think I have to springboard up through there. Yeah, this is marginally dangerous, but not too bad. And hey, yellow switch gives me a nice bonus. There's not much to say about this. It's pretty generic castle fare. It's easy enough. Oh, now we're riding platforms. This is slightly less generic castle fare. Oh. Trying to trick me with a sideways thwomp, are you? Ooh. And a somewhat dangerous jump. We have obstacle course shenanigans going on here. Fortunately, it's not the most dense obstacle course, and wow. 
Is that Jowie the poison cow from uh, dis a drama mystery? Because if so, I find that exceedingly hilarious. What I don't find hilarious is the fact that I can't actually get a bomb up there. There we go. Those bombs have a very short timer. Even when you th even after oh, I guess I'm throwing them up, so I don't reset the timer. All right, yellow jewel get. And it's been pretty short, so I'm gonna start world three. With a two le exits level. Colorful cave. Ooh. I fumbled that pretty badly. Okay. Again, it feels like I'm looking for a springboard. In fact, I am. Ooh, let's be a little bit more careful here. So, it says Colorful Cave. So far, I'm seeing three colors, at least. Which, technically is colorful, but... It's not what I... It's not what I think of when I think of colorful. Well, that was something. And... That pipe just... What? Okay, well, I found the secret exit. It took, like, no effort at all. But we have to do the colorful cave. We haven't seen enough color. I've only seen three. And granted, those three colors are everywhere, but still, it's only three color. When I think colorful, I think of lots of colors all over the place. Either just kind of slapdash together or in a pretty vibrant gradient. This is just kind of blocks of color. Blocks of very solid monotone color. Alright, I want this. Need it for here. So we've still got lots of blue and yellow and green. Where's the red? Oh, well, there's the red. Controls felt super loose there briefly. Oh, and it's a crusher section. I kind of figured it was, but it was taking an awful long time to get started. Okay, first problem, I don't know where it's gonna... where the crusher's gonna crush. No, not at all, I guess. So it crushed for one spot. Okay then. If you say so, game. Mount Ninji. Well, we got two paths, but let's go to Mount Ninji. I see ninjis. I also see a springboard that I need. Oh, but I can get it to it from up there. Boom! And up we go. And we got another vertical stage, although this one's pretty decent. See, when you have lots of... 
when you have a vertical stage that doesn't have lots of holes everywhere, that's pretty okay. Because then you're not at huge risk of losing all your progress all the time. And it's now it's transitioned to being horizontal again. We do have ninjis though. We have ninjis on ropes. It's the only way they can move to the side. That ninja has moved to the side so much, she is now frozen in time. And we have an amazing flying hammer bro that is not amazing nor flying. This is kind of like a hammer bro that can't move. That's it? <laughs> that stage didn't even take two minutes. I mean, I've done four stages, so I should, I'm gonna stop, but... It hasn't taken me very long. <laughs> anyway, that's all for me for now. Until next time, this is Doc. I'll see you later.